Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's YBC, and I'm back with a video. In this video, I'm gonna be bringing to you guys a gameplay with the brand new Pink Diamond Moments James Harden. Before I hop into the video and everything, if you guys can do me a quick favor and drop a like on the video, that would help me out a lot. Let's try and aim for 140 likes on this video. Now, moving on, taking a look at the card, he had a 50 point triple double last night. Now, that was definitely worthy enough for a pink diamond moment in which James Harden got today and this card art oh boy it looks fire and yeah in case you guys are wondering this is on my account not much has changed here is the squad I'm gonna start that Yao Ming I did decide to keep him just cause you know Yao Ming cards are really fun to use but aside from that not much has changed we're primarily and mainly going to be featuring this man right here in front of us so first things first, we're going to be taking a look at the badge. He does come with one Hall of Fame badge that is tireless score, as well as 20 other gold ones that include corner specialist, mid-range, dead-eye, one-man fast break, deep range, limitless range, difficult shots, pickpocket, hustle rebounder, catch and shoot, diamond, post riser, flop city, passer, acrobat, teardropper, putback king, pick and roll, maestro, relentless finisher, break starter, flashy passer, and ankle breaker. Moving on to his accessories right here, he does come with a good driving lamp at 97 and a really, really, really good draw foul at 98. 92 mid-range, which is also good. 92 optimal mid-range is really good, but we take a look at this 3 right here, and it is not so good at a 78. Now, the reason why he does have a 78 3 is because he did shoot 4 of 12 from 3. That kind of does suck. It kind of ruins the card just a little bit. But moving on, he does come with a 98 free throw, 84 driving dunk, 95 ball control, which is really, really good. He's going to have really good dribble moves. Really good passing as well. 80 steal. That's actually good for a James Harden card. 80 defense rebound. That's good for a shooting guard as well. 89 speed, 92 speed with ball, 77 lateral quickness, 98 stamina, 65 defensive consistency, 98 offensive consistency, and 90 reaction time. Honestly, this card looks really, really, really good, except for the open three ball at a 78. That kind of does ruin the card just a little bit. And with that being said, the diamond one might be better, but ultimately we're going to be seeing how he performs in a game. Let's go to work right here, James Harden. Give me a nice screen now. Make nice screen and roll. Good crossover move. We're taking it strong right here. Good two-handed finish. And John Stockton got dumped on. I didn't see him because... He was low-key, he was low-key kind of small, but John Stockton tried to take a charge and got dunked on. James Harden's on the wing right here. Come set me a good one, y'all. Nice pump fake. Oh, nice. Got him reaching. Don't reach because I will teach. John Stockton again getting dunked on. That's what I'm talking about. So far, Harden with two vicious slams. I like it. Good defense right there. R1, L1 to Harden on the break. Snatch back. Oh, yeah, attacking in middle. What are you doing, Stockton? Get out the paint. Tough layup. Really tough layup, but great finish by Harden. That's what he does. That's what he does, finishing those contact layups in the paint. So after those three buckets by Harden, my opponent switched and did a, now is doing an off ball. Is he off ball? Yeah, he's off balling me and put Diamond Iguodala on me, on James Harden instead of Jason Richardson. This is definitely going to be a test for Harden because we're going to see if he can perform against one of the best elite defenders in the game. Right now he's sending a double team at me and wow, you've got to be joking. Triple team this early on. Let's go. We're attacking the middle Granger. He needs to harden up top. We got the mismatch. Actually, we did. Now we did it. With five seconds left, the paint is open and Harden's attacking it. Middle. Drawing the foul. Going to be rewarded two free throws. And he does have a good free throw, 98. Really good. Probably the best for a moments card, you know, 98. They don't really give the best free throws to moments players, but... Harder with 98 free throw, that's so far the best, and does knock down two. No way, I'm right there. Good defense. R1-0-1 to Harden on the break. He's out of there. Let's shoot, let's shoot, let's shoot a three right here on the break. Green light! 78-3? But he does have a good release. I said hard out of money release. It is money. Open, wide open. But in a half-court setting, when you're trying to create a shot for yourself with Harden, it is slow and not fast, you know. But when you're wide open, it is money. As we knock down two of two right there from the line again. We were wide open. We were literally wide open, and we missed it with Harden, but he is on a break right here. He's going to get a nice slam dunk on the fast break, but he's wide open. That's the thing about this card, which really sucks. His three ball isn't good at all. Like, 78 for a James Harden card. That is kind of disrespectful in a way. As Granny's on a fast break, he gets a green line. Just like that, Harden has his takeover badges of... He's a half shot creating and half playmaking, so that's that's pretty good. R1 to L1, he got that break starter badge, and he's on a break, and then another one-handed slam dunk. So far, Harden is good, but at the same time, he did miss that wide open three, which really does suck because you can low-key play off of him pretty a lot, like low-key play off him a lot. And he won't make every single one of his threes because of how low his rating is. You know, you pretty much have to green it to have the best chance, obviously, at making it. But with some players like, for example, a Ray Allen 
Brown has like a 95-3, which is really, really hard to green. But yeah, because he has that 95-3, he'll he's gonna be making a lot of those full white bars and a lot of those full whites. With Harden, can I get the ball? Thank you. <laughs> With Harden, on the other hand, it's a lot different and more difficult in another two-handed slam on a fast break. Surprisingly, <laughs> he has 21 points this quarter and has only made one three. My opponent doesn't have an answer. So far, he's doing really, really good. Let's see if we can keep it up in the second quarter. Good defense from Magic. Let's go. Harden, pull up right here. Let's go. Let's see what this 75, 78 three ball is looking like. Okay. We got kind of lucky right there. We did, but it still went in. Harden so far, I believe, is like 2 of 5 from 3. We're up by 10 in my opponent's timeout. That's lightly. Magic got a lightly contest on that one. Okay. I guess that kind of makes up for Harden's lightly contest, so it's all good. Moving on to the next possession. My opponent is sending a double team. Wow. How many double teams are you going to send? Thank you. Defensive 3 in the key. All ball double teaming. It's not going to work against me. Let's go. Knock down this free throw. Harden is he is now 7 of 7 from the line. Yao Ming to Harden inside in the paint. That's a nice animation. One-handed standing dunk. He has 29 points. He's pressing, but the press isn't going to work against me. Harden is going to the paint in another one-handed slam. He has 31 points midway through the second quarter. Low-key, he's probably going to hit 40 before the half. Give me that steal. I'm right in that lane. You just gave it right to me. I'm going to take that. You're fouling me, and Harden is too much of a beast. He's doing his thing right now. Although he does have a 75-3 and my opponent does have a diamond eagle dollar guarding him. He is doing his thing as he is open again on the wing. And he missed it. Come on. So now my opponent switched into the zone. He is it looking like a 3-2 as we're going to dot Granger wide open in the corner. Good pass. Good shot. Bang. What a pass from Harden. That was beautiful. That was excellent. He, we have to get back, but... That was a great, really good pass. Really good vision and pass from Harden. And again, he does this time wide open. The opposite corner and bang! Harden with that vision. Playmaking for another teammate. And just like that, he has his second takeover badge of the game. Let's see what my opponent is in now. What type of defense he's in now? He's in regular, man. Okay, we got him out of that zone. Nice cross over here. Wide open. Harden green. Live splash on the wing. We're up by 15. My opponent's in timeout. Harden is literally cooking up. And right now, he is unstoppable. Oh, he blew that. I don't know how. Hard is on the break now and a two-handed dunk. He has some really good deck animation. That's something I do have to give him. Hard has some really good duck animations. Give me that. Give me that. I read that. Let's go. Oh, pull up right here. He's not stepping up. Open three ball. That's literally the thing about this card. If he had a 90 overall three, if he had a 90 or even like an 86 or closer to his diamond and amethyst, not a 78. If he had a better three than that, this man would be so ridiculously OP. That's the, really the only reason why he's missing those open threes is because his rating is so low. Nice screen by Yao. Harden taking it strong. He got blocked. Oh, wow, Yao, why did you go with that? Oh, what a pass from Turkaloo. Harden on the wing. Nice behind the back move. He's setting a double team, but a double team still won't stop him. Contested layup, but that's all James Harden right there. That's what he does. And with that layup, he does now have 40 points for the game. Good rebound by Magic, and Harden is leaking on the break. One behind the back move. We're attacking a strong middle. Wow, that, what a crazy dunk right there. Harden gets a steal and a three. Come on, give me one. Yeah, threes aren't really in this arsenal. They really aren't. I got a lightly contest on that. I don't know how that went, especially because my opponent did not green that shot. But anyways, Harden is open on a break. Come on, give me one. Give me one. You're open. Let's go. That's a three, too. Like, it's just, it's just very inconsistent from three. Very, very, very inconsistent. Good defense right there from Penny and Giannis to Harden on the left. Come on, show me some. Give me that three ball, Harden. Come on, let's go. He made two in a row and he's stirring up the pot. He's doing his thing. Like the only thing though about his three ball is that he's inconsistent. That's it. Give me that steal, Harden. Low keep playing good defense. As we're on the break. He's fouling me again. This is gonna be two more free throws. His release is so much, such money, and he has 98 rating. With that combined, pretty much gonna be knocking down every single free throw with uh, Pink Diamond James Harden. We do knock down two more right there. And just like that, we got a rage quit as Pink Diamond James Harden dropped 57 points through three quarters. Now it's too much for my opponent as we were up by 14, heading into the fourth, and he decided to lead the match. So yeah, GG's to my opponent. He did play a good one. Now moving on to the card review, I'm only going to give this man an 8.5 out of 10. Honestly, his three ball just really wasn't it for me. So yeah, I'm only going to give this man an 8.5. But moving on, take a look at the price difference. I'm going to show you guys the price difference the first day. 
Um, this is like the first day the card came out. Right now, this, the Pink Diamond James Harden is going for 140,000. He's probably going to push for 170. I honestly see this Pink Diamond James Harden settling for like 150,000 MT. He'll likely be 150,000 MT for a while. Now, the reason why I bring that up is because moving on to his Diamond card. Right now, his Diamond card is going for 90. We'll, we'll check for 100. Right now, he's going for 93,000 is the lowest. 88,000, 86. 86,000 is the lowest for this Diamond James Harden. Now, with that being said, the Pink Diamond is going for like pretty much almost twice as much as the Diamond one. Is it worth it? No, it's really not worth it, you know. They pretty much ha they have the same driving dunk. The Diamond has a better three ball. They both don't play defense. Like, why Why would you spend Why would you spend the extra MT for the Pink Diamond with the lower three ball and the same driving dunk? You know, it really doesn't make sense in my opinion. I highly recommend you guys just stick with this Diamond, you know. Don't upgrade. I wouldn't recommend upgrading at all, you know. Just keep your Diamond 1. The diamond 1 is just as good. He might even be... My opinion, Diamond 1 is better just because of the 3 ball. Like, if we take a look at the Diamond versus the Pink Diamond, the Pink Diamond has a better mid-range, and that is literally it. The Diamond 1 has a better 3 ball. So, with that being said, would you rather have a Diamond 1 with a better 3 ball and save yourself, like, 70,000 MT, or would you rather have a Pink Diamond 1 with just a better mid-range that costs more? I would rather pick the Diamond, you know? I mean, there's just literally one overall difference, and that one overall difference is definitely not worth 70,000 MT. I highly recommend, if you guys are thinking about getting a Diamond or Pink Diamond James Harden, I highly recommend you guys get the Diamond with the better three and save yourself some MT because the Diamond one is better than the Pink Diamond James Harden. So I hope you guys did enjoy. I did have a lot of fun using this James Harden, just in general, you know? James Harden cards are really fun to use. You know, just it just kind of sucks that they made the Pink Diamond one worse, but it is what it is. I still had a lot of fun recording this gameplay. So with that being said, if you guys are new, just make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. And also, if you guys can drop a like, that would be very, very helpful as well. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys had an amazing day, and I will catch you guys in the next one in this YBC, and I'm out. Peace.